two more weeks to earn a playoff spot, with the Philadelphia Eagles and the Washington football team being two teams fighting for that spot. The Eagles are in the best scenario possible, holding on to the seventh seed with a favorable schedule to close out the season. Washington, however, needs to win out and needs some help to get in. We asked you guys on social media who is going to win this game. 82% are favoring the Eagles, while 18% favors the football team. We're taking the Eagles to win by four. Playoff football is slipping away from the Baltimore Ravens, and they need to win against the Los Angeles Rams desperately. The Rams have a chance of advancing to the number two seed, while the Ravens and their struggling secondary will be in a very tough spot if they lose one more game. Taking it to the polls, you guys favor the Rams 79% while 21% is favoring Baltimore. We take the Rams to win by 10. The Tampa Bay Buccaneers versus the New York Jets. Tampa Bay clinched the NFC South last week and they have their sights now set on the number one seed. Zach Wilson showed promise last week in a victory against the Jaguars. Not a big game for the Jets, but for the Bucs, it's very important. 95% of you guys are favoring them to win, 5% are favoring the Jets. We take the Bucks to win by 21. Can the Miami Dolphins make it eight wins in a row? They'll have their toughest matchup in weeks against the Tennessee Titans. The Titans are just one win away from clinching the AFC South. The Dolphins would sneak in as a seventh seed if the playoffs were to start today. And if we take it to Instagram, you guys are favoring the Dolphins on the road 55% while the Titans are favored by 45% of you. We actually like the Titans at home to end the win streak, win by three. The Jacksonville Jaguars versus the New England Patriots. The Pats have been in a bit of a slump the last couple of weeks, with them losing and essentially missing out on the number one seed this season. The Jaguars season gets worse and worse after losing James Robinson to a torn Achilles. If we look at the polls, 93% like the Patriots to rebound, while 7% are favoring the Jags. We like the Patriots to win by 20. Two AFC playoff contenders in the Las Vegas Raiders and the Indianapolis Colts. When it seemed like the Raiders were out of it, two victories the last two weeks was enough to put them back into the race. Same goes with the Colts, who beat the Patriots and the Cardinals on back-to-back -back Saturdays to sit as a number five seed. Indy is hoping to get Carson Wentz activated off the COVID list in time. Looking at the polls, 85% like the Colts to win, while 15% like the Raiders. Give us the Colts to win by six. One of the games of the week, the Kansas City Chiefs versus the Cincinnati Bengals. Momentum favors both teams as the Chiefs look to win their ninth game in a row, while the Bengals are coming off a 525-yard passing performance by Joe Burrow. Can the Bengals put an end to the eight-game win streak? Well, if we ask you guys on Instagram, 67% say no. The Chiefs are going to continue to roll, while 33% like the Bengals. We like the Chiefs to win by nine. The New York Giants versus the Chicago Bears. This game has no playoff implications, but both head coaches are playing for the right to be retained for the 2022 season. Things are getting ugly offensively for the Giants, and the Bears are coming off a ballsy win against the Seahawks. Taking it to the polls, we like Chicago to win. 71% favors them, 29% likes New York. Give us the Bears to win by 10. The Atlanta Falcons versus the Buffalo Bills. The Falcons are technically in the playoff race, but are almost a long shot to make it given this difficult matchup. The Bills are in a great position. With the win, they have the best odds of moving up to the number three seed and increasing their odds of clinching the AFC East. Taking it to the polls, 88% like the Bills to win, only 12% likes Atlanta. We like the Bills to win big by 17. The number three overall pick from this past year's draft could be starting as the San Francisco 49ers face the Houston Texans. Jimmy Garoppolo could be sidelined with a thumb injury, allowing Trey Lance the opportunity to start this week. The Texans are coming off a surprising upset against the Chargers, the second big upset of their season behind their win against the Titans. Taking it to the polls, no upsets here. 92% like the 49ers, 8% like the Texans. Give us the 49ers to win by 10. Division rivals fighting to keep their playoff hopes alive. The Denver Broncos versus the Los Angeles Chargers. Denver is in the worst position between the two, with a loss eliminating them from playoff contention. The Chargers could jump up to the seventh seed with the win and a Dolphins loss. And if we look at the polls, you guys believe that the Chargers are going to split the series, 85% favoring LA, only 15% likes Denver. Give us the Chargers to win by 14. 
a miracle needs to happen for the New Orleans Saints as they need a victory and much more against the Carolina Panthers. The Saints activated Taysom Hill from the COVID-19 list and will have him start this week. The Panthers will start Sam Darnold at quarterback and will reassess their quarterback situation this offseason. If we look at Instagram, you guys favored the Saints to win in this game 79% versus 21%. Give us New Orleans to win by five. Another game with no playoff implications, the Detroit Lions versus the Seattle Seahawks. Jared Goff cleared COVID-19 protocols, but is still dealing with a knee issue. But his teammate, DeAndre Swift, will return after a four-game absence. Regardless of the outcome of the last two games, Pete Carroll will finish the season with the most losses he's ever had as the Seahawks head coach. Will this be a loss for Seattle? You guys don't believe so. 72% like Seattle to win, only 28% likes Detroit. We like the Seahawks to win by 13. While one team has been trending downwards, another team has been dominating. The Arizona Cardinals versus the Dallas Cowboys. Arizona is currently on a three-game losing streak. While they've already clinched a playoff spot, they're missing out on any hopes of hosting a home playoff game. Dallas, however, sits as the number two seed due to their well-balanced offense and turnover-causing defense. Looking at the polls, you guys believe this is going to be very, very close. 52% likes Dallas, 48% likes Arizona. Could go back and forth, but I got to go with the team that's been red hot. Give us the Cowboys to win by seven. Sunday Night Football, the Minnesota Vikings versus the Green Bay Packers. Much like the Saints, the Vikings need to win out and hope some teams lose in order for them to sneak into the playoffs. The Packers are holding on to the number one seed, with them currently having the best record in football. If we look at Instagram, 87% like the Packers to win, only 13% are favoring Minnesota. Wouldn't be a Vikings game if it weren't close. Give us the Packers to win by six. And finally, Monday Night Football. The Cleveland Browns versus the Pittsburgh Steelers. It's win now for both teams, as COVID has been a huge reason for the Browns potentially missing the playoffs. For the Steelers, this more than likely is Ben Roethlisberger's last home game in Pittsburgh, and he's historically been great against Cleveland. If we look at the polls, we're favoring the Browns to win in this one, but it's going to be close. 52% likes Cleveland, 48% likes Pittsburgh. Because of Ben Roethlisberger's history against the Browns, give us the Steelers in an upset to win by four.